Good morning. Welcome to the Crawford County Board of Commissioners meeting for March 10th, 2021. Uh, please turn your cell phone ring at sound again. We start with the pledge of allegiance with Commissioner Reader Span. Right. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And approval of the minutes from the special elected official salary meeting on February 22nd, 2021. So moved. Second. Properly moved. Second. Any discussion? Roll call. Henry? Yes. Sock? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Any approval of the minutes from the meeting on February 24th, 2021? I'll make that motion, but I'd like to amend the minutes with the uh, removal of Market House Girl from the list of uh, businesses that received. Uh, cares money in that one uh, that was inadvertently they were included in the list and they did not receive that I'll second I'll second that with that uh, amendment probably with a second with an amendment any discussion roll call please soft aye Wiederspan yes Henry yes any approved minutes in the work session on March 3rd 2021 so moved second probably with a second any discussion roll call Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Any approval of payment of bill in amount of $4,665,098.55 for the period ending March 9th, 2021. I'll make that motion. Second. It's probably moving second. Any discussion? Roll call? Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. There was no executive session. Is there anybody for public comment? No one for public comment. We'll start with the registered recorder. Good morning, Commissioners. Good morning, Beth. Good morning, Beth. I'm seeking approval for the Optical Storage Solutions uh, Software Support Agreement, effective March 1st, 2021. That is a one-year contract, and the contract has been reviewed by Attorney Keith Buck. So moved. Second. Properly moved. Second. Any discussion? Roll call. Soft. Aye. Wiederspan. Yes. Henry. Yes. Okay. And the second item, I'm seeking approval for the transfer of funds in the amount of $1,614.55 from special account number 209, Records Improvement Fund, to the Crawford County Commissioners. Uh, this account was originally opened for the deposit of register and quarter internet transfers, but hasn't been used since October 4, 2016, due to a software change. So moved. Second. Properly moved. Second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Thank you, Beth. Thanks, Beth. Thanks, Thank Beth. Thank you, Commissioner. Beth Forb is now exiting. Adult probation? Good morning, Commissioners. This is Trevor. Good morning, Trevor. Good morning, Trevor. Um, this morning, the two agenda items I have are both funded from a CJAB coronavirus grant awarded from PCCD on or about uh, February 9th of uh, 2021. Uh, the first item is uh, to ratify the purchase of 30 Dell uh, laptop computers, docking station, and carrying bags at the cost of $1,033 each. Um, for each three-piece combination, the total of this adds to $30,000. $990. So moved. Second. Properly moved. Second. Any discussion? Roll call. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. And the uh, second item would be to ratify the purchase of nine Microsoft Office Standard 2019 at the cost of $321.34 each for a total cost of $2,892.06. I'll make that motion. Second. Properly moved. Second. Any discussion? Roll call. Soft. Aye. Wiederspan. Yes. Henry. Yes. Thank you, Trevor. Thank, Thank you, Trevor. Trevor Oates is now exiting. Assessment office. Good morning, commissioners. Good morning, Joe. Uh, I have a few items to, for your uh, approval this morning. First being uh, to approve the annual uh, fund tuning payment in lieu of taxes. So moved. For 
I'll second. Probably do a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Zoc? Aye. Item B uh, would be to ratify the Board of Revisions change of the appeal deadline notification to August 1st, effective this year. I'll make that motion. Second. That's probably the second. Any discussion? Roll call. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. And the last item on the agenda for assessment is a formal ratification of a refund for Forever Media. Uh, the county refund amount would be for $2,224.68 for a double assessment of a commercial building and fencing in Hayfield Township. So moved. Second. Probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Thank you, Joe. Thank you, Commissioner. Thanks, Thanks Joe. Joe. Public safety. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Greg. Good morning, Greg. This morning, just looking to ratify the payment of $553.71 to Mobilecom for installing a wireless router and uh, UHF radio in the multi purpose vehicle. I'll make that motion. Second. It's probably moving. Second. Any discussion? Here's the board in Tyson Harold. He is now joining. Any discussion? Roll call. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Thank you. We'd also like to ratify the contract with McCutcheon Enterprises for providing a Type A hazardous materials response team for Crawford County at a cost of $2,500 annually. This will be paid out of the HAZMAT response fund. So moved. Second. It's properly moved. Second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Thank you, Greg. Thanks, Greg. Thank you, Greg. PSB Supervisor Office is now exiting. Crawford County Care Center? I'm sorry, Crawford County Correctional Facility? Go ahead, Good morning, Commissioner. I'm sorry, Dad. Ben today. Good morning, Good morning, Ben. We're looking for approval for a payment of $3,285.78 for replacement costs to stainless steel toilets. The original porcelain toilets were vandalized by inmates. This is to be paid through the commissary fund. So moved. Second. Probably with a second. Any discussion? Roll call, please. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Okay. Next item item is to approve payment of $18,000 to New Tech Incorporated for a three year full coverage maintenance agreement. This is also be paid for through the commissary fund. So moved. Second. Probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Thank you, Ben. Thank you. Thank you. Ben Fair is now exiting. Crawford County Planning. Good morning, Commissioners. Good morning, Good morning Zachary. Uh, first item is to ratify a cooperation agreement with Economic Progress Alliance of Crawford County for professional services and administering the COVID-19 hospitality industry recovery program, CHIRP. I'll make that motion. Second. It's probably move it second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Next item is to approve three invoices from the Titusville Herald totaling $335. These include a 2020 uh, request for qualification advertisement for $34.50, a 2021 uh, advertisement for request for qualifications in a total of $150.25, and a second advertisement for the same item right, for the same amount. So moved. Second. Properly move a second the discussion. Roll call. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Uh, next is in a, to approve an economic progress alliance invoices for underwriting services regarding the county small business assistance program. This is paid through the community development block grant program. Those invoices are for November uh, and February. Both are $440. Make that motion. Second. That's probably the second. Any discussion? Roll call. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. 
Lastly, we're asking for approval of uh, payment to small business assistance uh, requisitions for two businesses. These are paid through the City of Titusville CDBG program. The first is Henderson's Electric in the total of $10,000. The second is for Strawbridge Pools in the total of $10,000. So moved. Second. It's probably the second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Saw? Aye. Thank you, Commissioners. Thanks, Zach. Thank Good morning. Zachary Norwood. Now you didn't take your cue, Mark. Is now exiting. <laughs> Good morning, Mark. Good morning, Mark. Maintenance, go Sorry. ahead. Sorry, that was premature. That's okay. He's anxious. Okay. Um, asking approval to pay invoices for the courthouse remodeling project, specifically the new finance office, the amount of one hundred and four dollars and nine cents. So move. Second. It's probably moving. Second. Any discussion? Roll call. Henry. Yes. Saw. Aye. Wiederspan. Yes. I'm asking approval uh, to accept a quote for the courthouse remodeling project for Folks Flooring America uh, to carpet the uh, finance office and the two small conferences conference, conference rooms on the third floor for six thousand four hundred dollars. So moved. Second. It's probably moved. Second. Any discussion? Roll call. Soft. Aye. Wiederspan. Yes. Henry. Yes. <laughs> Ask an approval uh, to accept a quote for the courthouse remodeling project to paint the finance office and the new conference room on the third floor from Steve Stats painting uh, for $1,475. Move. Second. It's probably move in second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Soft. Aye. Ask and approval to ratify um, hiring EADS architects to provide architectural services for the window replacement project at the courthouse. This will be for $34,900. So moved. Second. It's probably moved in second. Any discussion? Roll call. Henry? Yes. Saw? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Ask and approval to ratify the uh, purchase of sidewalk salt from Meadville Ace Contractor Center for $1,356.53. So moved. Second. Probably move second. Any discussion? Roll no call. Saw? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Thank you, Mark. Thanks, Mark. I'm going to stay on. Okay, thank you. Thank, thank you. Human Services? Good morning, Commissioners. Good morning, Good morning. First item this morning is uh, ratification of the emergency rental assistance grant application for $5,566,075.02. These grant funds can be used to provide financial assistance to eligible households to pay rent, rental arrears, utility and utility arrears, and other housing related expenses incurred due to directly or indirectly to COVID-19. This grant runs from 3-8 of 21 to 1231 of 21. And there are no county match. There's no county match on these funds. So moved. Second. Probably move second. Any discussion? Just thank you, Gail. It's a, a huge task. And thank you to Jason Nesbitt, the San Family Services, for what he's doing with that, too. Absolutely. Thank you. Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Next, I have an intellectual disabilities provider enrollment revalidation application. It's a five-year application renewal required by medical assistance to revalidate our medical assistance promise ID that we use in order to build case management services. I'll make that motion. Second. Probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Henry? Yes. Soft? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Next is a mental health base service unit provider enrollment revalidation application, also a five-year application renewal required by medical assistance, and this is um, for us to build mental health assessments. So move. Second. It's probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Saw. Aye. Wiederspan. Yes. Henry. Yes. Next, I have a purchase requisition to Havoc Motors Tires and Services for the replacement of an electronic Steering assembly, cost to the county is $258.30. So moved. Second. It's probably moved in second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Saw? Aye. I have a purchase requisition to the Pennsylvania Association of County Human Service Administrators for the 2021 annual membership dues. Cost to the county is $248.25. So 
So moved. Second. Probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Henry? Yes. Saw? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Seeking your approval of a fiscal year 2021 systems of care contract with the Conneaut School District for training and engagement activities for their Wear All Belong program delivered at the Conneaut Valley Middle School. Total cost is $1,360, all paid with SOC grant funds. So moved. Second. Probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Saw? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Next, a 2021 Systems of Care contract with Crawford County Mental Health Awareness Program, CHAPS, for the delivery of the Pathfinders Program, which is a site-based site rehab program for youth, uh, costs $7,000. Host homes, $59,240.73. Uh, this is to pilot their transition age youth home. Uh, third item is family peer support for $41,281.95. And this program will assist parents and caregivers raising children up to the age of 26 who are experiencing mental health challenges, all paid with systems of care funds. So moved. Second. Probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Weider Span? Yes. Yeah. Henry? Yes. Saw? Aye. And the last item today is a CYS contract with Samantha Perrine. She's our MDIT coordinator and <coughs> child family advocate. She's responsible for obtaining intake information, follow up with children and families after a forensic interview, and maintaining the NCA track database. Her position is funded through a PCCD grant, and the contract max, the contract max is $37,560 no county dollars. So moved. Second. Probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Henry? Yes. Saw? Aye. Wiederspan? Yes. Thank you, Gail. Thank you. Thanks, Thank Gail. you, and I'm going to stay on the line. Thank you. Finance? Good morning. Good morning, Good morning. I am seeking approval of invoices totaling $881,657.61. These were detailed at the work session last Wednesday. Uh, so moved with a question. Yes. I'll second it with that same question, I believe. Do we have a change? Um, yes, there was a change. Human Services, upon doing an audit of their match invoicing, found errors totaling $11,000. So we have a credit of $11,000 for the county match. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Probably move a second. Any other discussion? No. Roll call. Saw. Aye. Wiederspan. Yes. Henry. Yes. And finally, uh, invoices for ratification totaling one million eighty-six thousand nine hundred twenty-eight dollars and seventy-seven cents. These were also detailed at the work session on Wednesday. So move. Second. Probably move a second. Any discussion? Roll call. Wiederspan? Yes. Henry? Yes. Saw. Aye. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you. Thank you Stephanie. We have a new hire transfer form. Uh, I'll make a motion we approve the request of new hires employee transfers as detailed in our packet with a question. I'll second it. Probably so, a second in discussion. So I, I see the first one. We've already moved Todd to a different position. Formal. Todd's been uh, out of that meeting three position for quite a long time. I okay. believe Mark said he's still on the line. Okay. That is correct, isn't it, Mark? Yes, he was moved out of that years ago. Okay. But it was just still left on the books that way. That's why we have to list it this way as replacing him in that position, even though he hasn't had it for a while. Correct. Okay. And that Good. Jason was going to that position. That, that clears it up. Thank you. Well, any other discussion? Yeah, I'm along with that. The effective date is 311, but that's the earliest start date for Jason. It may not be exactly 311. It may be uh, later than that, or it could be 311. So just so we're aware. Okay. Any other discussion? No. Roll call, please. Henry. Yes. Saw. Aye. Weider Span. Yes. Okay. Uh, for your information, the meeting dates are listed below. Uh, any commissioner comments? Commissioner Saw. Um, actually nothing. Thank you, though. 
Yeah. I know, right? But Rare is the day I when I don't say that the petitions we're in, we might have a lottery coming up, something like that, but that's okay. Well, I will mention, I don't know about a lottery. <laughs> I, I guess it is a lottery, maybe, kind of. Um, it is kind of casting of lots for, for all those candidates who have filed their petitions. Uh, deadline, of course, was yesterday. Um, the official casting of lots will be next Wednesday, March the 17th. I uh, believe at noon, and the location of that will be in courtroom, former courtroom one here at the courthouse, so it's on the second floor. Okay. Mr. Wieske. I would just kind of tag along on what Commissioner Soft said. I'd just like to thank all those people who are willing to run for public office, uh, willing to take the time, and uh, not only just to get the signatures, but uh, willing to serve if they're so elected by the people of Crawford County. So I just thank you. Thank them for that willingness to serve and certainly thank the, our voter services department for handling that workload. It, this is a, one of those years where you have quite a few uh, people filing because of the numerous county offices and township offices and so forth up on the ballot. So I'd just like to thank everybody for being part of the democratic process. Good. And I would just close with, uh, there, there are obviously two programs. The rental assistance you heard about, you can go through the Center for Family Services. That's, that's a lot of money for our county, and that's good. People should take advantage of that. And also the church program uh, through the EPAC, which you, if you have a, you know, a, a hospitality venue and you fall within that category, you're certainly eligible for that as well. One thing with the, uh, the rental assistance, we are actually working with public safety uh, to utilize our mobile response vehicle to provide uh, mobile areas to actually help with the rental assistance. We've talked with Jason and we'll be in multiple sites across the county where they'll be able to come to that vehicle, uh, uh, actually use the internet, hook up there, and uh, get their, their uh, registration done for that. So that's exciting to know that uh, we're able to use some other county resources to help with the rental program. So we'll be talking about that more in, in the future. Uh, with that, I'll take a motion for adjournment. So moved. I'll second. We are adjourned. Thank you.